Ayodhya was a magnificent city on the banks of river Sarayu in Kosala country. It had wide roads, huge buildings, beautiful parks and glittering shops. The people of the city lived a happy and contented life as they were ruled by a wonderful king called Dasrath. He cared for his people very deeply. King Dasrath had three wives, Kausalya, Sumitra and Kaikeyi. Kausalya was the eldest queen. Though the king loved all his wives deeply, it was Kaikeyi, his youngest queen, who was his favorite. But in spite of leading such a good life, Dasrath was still an unhappy man. This was because he had no children. He was getting old and had no son to ascend to the throne. Unable to see the king being sad, the sages advised him to undertake a yajna and pray for children. Heeding to their advice, he performed a yajna and pleased with him. Agni, the fire god, emerged out of the fire pit, handed over a cup containing sweetened milk to the king and told him, O king, this kheer is, is the nectar of life. It was prepared by the gods in the heaven. Distribute it among your wives. You will be blessed with sons. Dasratha was delighted. He thanked Agni for his boon and in the royal chamber gave Kausalya half of the kheer. He divided the remaining kheer into two persons and gave one person to Sumitra and other one to Kaikeyi. Subsequently, all the three queens gave birth to sons. Kausalya gave birth to Rama, after which Bharata was born to Kaikeyi. And later on, Sumitra gave birth to Lakshman and Satrukna. King Dasarath was very happy and so were the people of Ayutthaya. With great reasons, they celebrated the birth of the four princes. Dasratha loved all his sons, but Rama was his dearest. He was very proud of his handsome eldest son and could not bear to be away from him even for a moment. 